A huge thank you to Levithan, Johnny, Angus, Silvanor, Haxo, and Andreas for being mega supporters on Patreon and pledging five or more dollars per month. You guys are absolutely amazing, and without you, the channel wouldn't exist. So thank you again, and I hope you enjoy the video. Hey, hey, everybody, it's Overkill here with episode three of the Crusader Kings 2 Kingdom of Wessex campaign. So in the last episode, um, we dealt with the end of Typhoid Fever, and we also took Sussex, which is good. So we've... Um, We've uh, increased the size of Wessex um, by another county, which is great. And now we have our attention set to Surrey, um, which we'll be able to take quite easily due to the size of our uh, our army. But uh, yeah, so something that I forgot that you could do was actually upgrade this stuff. So I have a lot of, and I mean a lot of gold, so I'm going to use that to build some stuff. Um, this one would be good. The castle town would give us more tax income, so we'd be putting a, we'd be putting money into something that would be paying us back. Um, but of course, this also gives us more levies and stuff. So something like that would be quite useful. But of course, we have enough money that once that's done, we could build anything we want. We also want to build a shipyard, of course, so that we can start building uh, ships. But yeah, so we're just gonna continue along. Um, but yeah, I do really appreciate all the support on the first few episodes. Oh, let's see. Or the f well, only the first episode's been out since I recorded this one. But uh, my court physician, Bishop uh, Ken Wolf, has let me know that the surgical tools I bought him were quite useful. Oh, good, excellent. But uh, yeah, you know, uh, it was actually pointed out to me that I haven't done this yet, so that was nice. Um, but yeah, so Alfred's our king right now, Theodora of Asturias is almost old enough. Uh, as your efforts of gaining wealth grow all the more determined, you sleep less and less. Okay, I'm stressed. Yeah, we'll definitely want to get rid of that. Hmm. can't hold a feast. Oh, it has to be November. Oh, okay. Oh, oops. Yeah, we'll just play on three times speed. But yeah, you can see like how much money we're making. It's crazy. Raking it in. Um, but of course, like I could build stuff in these places as well. So I may as well actually do that. We may as well get tax income wherever we can, basically. Oh, jeez. That was very loud. My mother died. She died of cancer. Oh, she f finally succumbed to her cancer. That's not good. I'm hoping that, um... I'm hoping that my family, like me and my, my siblings, don't succumb to that as well. Because that would be quite bad. Wouldn't like that very much. But yeah. It's unfortunate that she died. So yeah, if I keep building these, the tax income will be very useful. Very useful indeed. Yeah, we may as well bump it up to four times speed, why not? Um, she still hasn't come of age. Oh, she's only 10, that's right. Once she is old enough, that'll be good. Still another six years or so. Orthodox fate triumphant. Yeah, I really hope that at least I don't, you know, get hit with cancer. If my brothers and sister do, I mean, it's not the end of the world. But, yeah. Castle walls have been built in Winchester. Good. Just got our levy reinforcements. Excellent. So we're just waiting on our claims of Surrey. It'd be nice 
least those can be finished now. I need castle walls too for that. We need shipbuilding of one. I definitely want to save up for that. Improve the relations with the Pope, good. Oh, my brother is now of legal age. He's a brilliant strategist, so we'll definitely want him to be our military leaders. Castle walls, or castle towns, have been finished. That's good. That means I could build more in Winchester if I wanted to. Beautiful. Oh, if I just build the shipyard straight up, it'll give me some ships. Okay, but we'll stop spending money now. Still waiting for a claim on Surrey. You have 18% yearly, or 18% chance yearly. Ooh, Cornwall is quite weak. Or oh, there's two Cornwalls now, but yeah. Maybe I should switch my focus to Kent. Oh. According to your marshal, Ain Ainfrith, the peasants of Somerset are having frequent troubles with highwaymen and wild beasts. He uh, suggests constructing a series of outposts along the roads. Yes, definitely. We may as well. Ooh. Saxony has invaded all the way down here. Interesting. Uh, no laws we can change. The shipyard has been finished. Excellent. Our vassals wouldn't like us, but we'd get a bit more tax. needs to hurry up and grow up so that we can have children. Because I need an heir other than my brother. That would be nice. Yeah, our shipyards are finished. Oh, there we go. Look, we have it already. It'll take lots of gold and prestige, but we can then just instantly start the war. That amount alone is perfectly suitable. We only have 500 men about. Alright, so once they're all together, group them. I don't want, yeah, okay. I didn't want myself being the leader. Oh. How come I can't use my brother or anything? Ah, yes. I do want you to be a commander. You can call Lombardy into this. Don't really feel that it's necessary. Yeah, we'll make Aethelred our commander there. And now we will move in. Move in for the kill. Easily 
actually breaking their army there. Now they're just down to 151 men. We can shut the gates. Oh no, not again. <sighs> Bloody tuberculosis. I spread it here as well. Who are these jokers? Ormondian? Interesting. Yes, yeah, shut the gates. Ah, oh, they're gonna band together and besiege some of my places. I'm just gonna go ahead and just crush their army. Uh, Marshal Mayor Ainfrith told me about his ideas. I couldn't really understand what he was talking about, but he was adamant in his belief this would improve the military. I can spare four gold. Alright, we shattered their army there. Oh, did he die? Died a natural death. Okay. That was a good chancellor, though. Alright, he's coming back. Chest pains. Oh, lovely. Oh, I, I, I got camp fever. I don't know. That didn't really do anything. Right, I'm just trying to crush this army. Oh, no. Did my brother... Oh, he got locked away. That's what it was. Chasing this army around. Oh, excellent. Alright, catch them again. There. Oh, nope, they've joined forces again. I mean, I can just ignore them. But, there's no point. I may as well just destroy them. good like how how strong is Somerset like can it withstand them oh it can okay I'm gonna go siege Kent then yeah that's fine imagine the situation which became more and more intimidating with an outcome that would mean life or death I swallowed hard and decided that I would Stay put and fight. Yeah, so we have open council positions. Um, he'll have to do. Let's fabricate claims on Surrey now. Yeah, once we win a siege here, it should be fine. Our land is just infested with... Ugh, most of England is infested with, with uh, tuberculosis. What am I suffering from? Chest pains, right. So my health is down. But we should be fine. Lately, Wolfron of Winchester has been showing symptoms of illness. She might have contracted the plague. She has to go. Is this my daughter? No, just a courtier. Oh. Well, who are you? Just a daughter of one of my courtiers. Okay. I'm not gonna hug her. Let's see how that plays out. Plays out. If she has uh, the plague, that'll be very bad. Same event just popped up twice. That's interesting. Oh, no. <sighs> Damn. 
it's a good thing that the succession like passed on nicely that I didn't lose anything but oh, maybe it's for the best would I be able to oh excellent okay good we got a good actually I didn't check her traits though shit she might be bad Oh, we've won the war. Alright, let's end this. Damn, it sucks that he died. So now we're playing as Aethelred. Alright. Uh, she's ambitious, temperate. She's a craven, though, but that's not really that big of a deal. He's my uncle. Very interesting. Oh shit, so I'm marrying my cousin. Whoops. <laughs> oh well. I don't really, really want to break the patrol though. Anyway, we're missing everybody. You're a great marshal, that's good. You're a decent steward. Um, you're a good spy master. And you're a great dude. My sister with the Prince of Middle Francia. Yeah, sure. An ambition for you? I would like for you to become King of England. You're young. It might be possible. Character focus. No reason for seduction yet. Oh, your diplomacy is very bad. But your uh, your marshal is very good. Yeah, let's get some diplomacy up, just so he's not so much of an idiot. <laughs> All right, I definitely need to get some children for him. A title can be created: the Duchy of Kent. Do I really need that though? I mean, we may as well. Now we can press... Oh, well, that allows us just to press claims. That's right. And yeah, just these men alone will be enough to crush their forces. Alright, let's get the whole army together. Uh, our marshal is leading there. Oh, that is him. Alright. Actually, split in half. This half goes there, these guys go here. Alright, this should be a very quick, easy war. Good, we defeated them there. Excellent. Uh, we captured him. Good. Oh, we captured a couple of people. Alright. Even better. Special title actions. Oh, set the crown focus. Of course. Here, as always. We could definitely use more money. Of course, our expenses are taking up a lot of that. Oh, no, 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 no. Damn it. Oh, no, we... Oh, we did manage to just barely defeat them, but they outnumber us greatly. Alright, we may have to... Who are these people? Where did they come from? Hey, that's not just Surrey. Um, but we may need to get some mercenaries, some cheap ones would be preferable. 150 is the cheapest it seems. Oh, I can end the war now. 
Alright, never mind then. Just disband them. That was foolish. I should have been paying more attention. That was a waste of money. But, oh well. Can I get shipbuilding? No, not yet. Castle infrastructure. Life in seclusion isn't so bad. Whoa. Oh, we're running out of food. Okay. We're gonna have to come out of seclusion and deal with all of this. Oh gosh. Not good. Everybody's gonna get sick. Oh. gonna start so yeah we're being ravaged by one all right next claim on Devin we'll just have to watch and wait and hopefully uh, hopefully we can be fine I also have a prisoner. Can't ransom him, can't release him. Well, he'll just stay in there then. Yeah, that was a big mistake. Buying those mercenaries when I didn't have to. He's a pretty good, he has some good traits. We do need to wait for her to grow up. But good. The kingdom is looking nice. If we could just take Essex and of course Devon and uh, Cornwall, that would be great. Now we have 1100 men. Uh, to the most illustrious King Ethelred, the good uh, burghers of Elchester are barely able to pay their taxes. Our coffers are empty. I humbly ask that you lower the taxes. Uh. Just sue them. Hopefully he falls for it. I mean, my diplomacy isn't that high. Seems nothing's coming of it, so that's fine. Because this could be a lot worse. <laughs> you don't like me very much, but then again, I just conquered you, so that's why. Oh no, not again. Please, I don't want to lose another guy. Consumption. Oh, I did. Okay, I got consumption. Great. Shit. This is this is freaking me out. Where's my court's position? Oh. oh. 
Thank God. Alright, I don't want to lose another king already. Not until we at least have a kid. Consumption, hopefully, goes away. It's starting to leave these areas, so I'm hoping that it soon disappears. Measles has come into there. Oh, it's left Somerset. Okay, so it should start dissipating from my lands, too. I'm not going to shut the gates again. Oh, I don't know what that was. Start of the Viking Age. Oh, boy. Centralization of power in Scandinavia along with a rapid population expansion has begun to drive its denizens to look beyond the home shores in earnest. The Viking Age begins. Alright, let's do it. There's still Northumbria and Mercia that could be at the mercy of the Northmen before us, hopefully. But, uh... We will be ready. A prominent subject has positioned me for justice. His daughter has supposedly been beaten by Marshal Mayor. Oh no. Hmm. I don't want to lose my Marshal. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, it must be lying. If there's a revolt, we should be able to stop it. But it's only a 1.5% chance, so if it happens, I'm... I'll be very surprised. <laughs> Alright, it's starting to subside now, which is good. Crazy. Oh, need medium tribal, high tribal, absolute tribal. Good. It's only in Winchester now, and then it's gone. Right, we're only a couple of years away from her being ready. I mean, realistically, I could just try to find somebody that isn't my cousin. <laughs> and I w really didn't pay attention to that. Oh, good. It's all gone. Oh, but now there's the Dancing Plague. Oh no. Earl Broda of Surrey has inherited that from his father. Died comatose in bed. So you're my new vassal. Okay. Fine enough. Steady on. I think... We are out of time, if I check my timer real quick. Yes, we are. So, I guess we will have to say our goodbyes for now. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and a comment down below, as always. And, of course, the dancing plague is spreading all across England. Oh, boy. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and a comment down below, as always. And if you're enjoying this series, make sure you subscribe, because there's going to be plenty more coming where this came from. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.